What's up, Panduth? Peter Von Panda here. Hey, I want to show you another one of my watches. This one, uh, it comes from Filson, you know, your Seattle-based outdoor life outfitter. Uh, but it's made by Shinola, and that's why I kind of got into them. I want to say the uh, owner of Shinola is also the owner of Filson. He's kind of been buying up these distinct brands that are otherwise having some trouble. So I just wanted to show this one to you, give you a quick tour through it. This is a Journeyman watch, and... Uh, as you can probably see here, let me see if I can screw down crowns. So you pop it out like this, screw it down. You know, it's kind of interesting in that it's the the crown to me kind of looks like the back end of a of a bullet. You know, with that kind of copper inset piece there, and it says CC Filson Watch Company or, or Filson Company, and. It's, it's cool. I like the detail on it. There is an knurling, but it kind of alternates between this ribbed part and um, kind of smooth part. So it's nice. It's uh, got a nice size to it. So anyway, my hands are all chapped. It's all winter. So you unscrew it, pull it out here, and then uh, let me see if I can move the hands here a little bit, get it out of the way. So you can see Argonite 515 movement, which is their GMT movement, Ronda based, or it is a Ronda movement effectively. Yeah, 660 feet water resistance. So uh, you can see that it's GMT by the fourth hand. This one's in orange. It's got loom across the dial here. So nice bright loom uh, on the applied hour markers as well as the hands and the 12, 3, 6, and 9 hour numbers, which are also applied. So you get really cool depth to the watch. I mean, it feels like a chunky watch. You can see here it's got nice thickness, but like all the Shinolas, the crystal is a, usually a curved crystal, so it's a nice big thick crystal, nice big thick piece of uh, brushed stainless steel here, a really deep um, deep bezel. Uh, you can see minute markings on kind of the, the outer ring. And then the, the inner dial itself, and it might be a little hard to see here, is slightly textured. It's like a really miniature stucco. Um, so, so it has just a little bit of like... Um, uh, texture and that's kind of gives it a little more like outdoor cred and you know uh, it's nice because it doesn't reflect very much especially if you're using some bright sunlight but uh, the the coolest the thing about this is that uh, there's so many features on this dial obviously it is uh, at the four o'clock position there you can see a date window but what you do here is I believe if you pull it out to the first position um, and you rotate it clockwise you adjust the date now if you rotate it counterclockwise you adjust that fourth hand there, the GMT for the second time zone. So I could throw it to a six o'clock um, or whatever, and then adjust my time by pulling it out one more stop. And again, clockwise or counterclockwise, and then push it all back in, hacking seconds hand, and then tighten it all down. And now everything's going to move in sequence. Now, the, the thing to remember here is that your time, the minute and the hour hand here is going to move on a 12 hour cycle, but this fourth uh, hand here for the GMT, the second time zone, is gonna move on a 24 hour cycle. So uh, throughout the day, obviously yours is gonna move twice, and then um, this one is only gonna move all the way around. So that's kind of, you have gotta kind of remember that. Now the nice thing is they put those military, those 24 hour markings all the way around on this black, looks like it's ion plated, maybe PVD, black uh, inner ring and then you have this uh, movable bezel which is kind of in this cool olive anodized green with time zone so if you know what time zone or you've picked you can move that to the top of your um, so in this case like Seattle you move that to the top so you know exactly what your GMT hand is always looking at so really cool I you know I won't go into it but uh, a lot of the detail because you've seen some of the Filson watches before these um, crown protectors here are actually pushers if this were a chronograph so they look just like the chronograph but these are these are fixed they don't move um, really nice curved you know really comfortable watch to to wear uh, you know nice weight like I said it's got that copper coin looking thing on the back here that matches the crown and so it's just a really cool pretty looking watch um, and even the band here is like a canvas cordura kind of almost like a denim it's like a blue or black so just uh really comfortable to wear i like it filson journeyman peter von panda out